One, two, three. This is my third Timu haul. So, I'm second time I'm trying to record this video. So I've already cracked open the bag, and then I had a little mishap. So let me go over what I've already opened up. It's only been four items. First off, my little piggy obsession. This dude is to go with the other one. The other one looks like he's uh, tied up, like he's been caught. And this one looked, reminded me and gave me uh, cop, cop vibes with the uh, chip glasses there. So these are going to go in my car just to add a little fun. So that was the, one of the items that I had already shown. And then things went awry. Uh, the other thing that I already showed was this, which is a silicone mat, which is for nails. So it has some de some information in regards to consistency of the beads, if you're doing acrylic um, placement, etc. Um, it also has all of the shapes that are out there now. And... It has uh, a prep and scope. So this has to have belong to something, but I'm not sure exactly what that is. But it has a measuring tool. It has some shapes. So I guess you can try to replicate that. So I've been getting into nails um, at home myself. Doing all kinds of gel, this, what, whatever, dips and stuff like that. So wanted to have something to work on and some place to practice because you can actually do some designs on here and they can wipe off with acetone. So that was good. I also got another shirt. So hit or miss with the clothing. Um, I haven't been putting them on or showing anything, but I've been trying different sizes and different styles. This is a regular shirt. Nothing too fancy. It is kind of thin. You'd have to be careful Watch what, what kind of bra you're wearing or maybe wear a camisole underneath it, a little thin one. It's a 6X. I bought an 8X dress, which felt too big. Then I bought a 7X dress, which felt not enough big. This is a 6X. It feels kind of like it should be fine, but again, not so sure until you get it on. But you know what? They're relatively inexpensive. Six or seven dollars for each of those different items. Um, also showed that I had this, which was a headband to put around to uh, cover with one of my wigs that I've purchased in the past. It has that headband and then the wig part. So I wanted something to put over that headband so it's not always the black standard, you know, band. I was also thinking I could put like pins so I might be ordering some pins <laughs> off of Timu at some point. Uh, okay, so this is, um, I'm not sure what this is. <laughs> it's probably my child because what I was saying in the other video then um, was that I don't know what's in this bag because Timu takes your orders. Because you know we're all addicted, right? So you place an order. It's supposed to come. Maybe it comes on time. Maybe it doesn't. You get your $5 for being late, etc., etc. Then the $5 is sitting there. Then you're like, oh, let me look at some other stuff. Or you go watch other people's Timu and then you say, oh, I want that. And what happens? The vicious cycle. So you got three or four orders out there, but they're not or they're not filling them in their entirety. They're, fi they're filling them partially. And then what happens? You're getting a bag, which might have from three different orders. And that's a little bit frustrating. Okay, so this is a tapestry of some sort. Uh, okay, I think this is mine. If you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. Yes, this one is mine. So this I wanted to hang up in my classroom. I'm very frustrated this recent years because I feel that the kids are just not caring anymore. And, um, I could have a whole other series about what's going on, you know, but I wanted to, um, put something up there, which sent a message, but wasn't as aggressive as sometimes, um, some messages can be. <laughs> so this is going to be hung up in my classroom just to emphasize the fact that, you know, these kids have to put in the effort and, um, that's something that a lot of the teachers are struggling with now. 
so yeah this one was mine there's another tapestry i think in here that belongs to my child so that's for work throw that right there oh some more jewelry so this is why i bought the scissors over here so i don't wrestle with the uh opening of these i got some of these in gold i like gold i like gold on occasion i'm more of a silver girl but i did get some to pass on to friends who were saying that they wanted some dangly earrings i also got regular study kind of stud study stud study <laughs> stud kind of earrings which one these are for me for silver you know these are cute they're like um I don't know how this is not working like it doesn't want to focus we're doing this again anyway they're cute they're just simple little round they almost give me compass vibes but anyway. the earrings are mad inexpensive over there they're like a dollar a dollar two dollars I think the most expensive earrings that I had purchased was like 250 this is another nail product so these are lint free wipes and even though I have some um, I got these just because they're green and green is my favorite color, one of my favorite colors but they do come in a nice little container and if once this container is used up you have yourself a container again another couple of box boxes um, I know a lot of people put the prices and stuff like that on the screen that's not something that I'm doing so I don't know if that's something that you want because then I might have to do videos that are in um, shorter format and I might need to break a bag up into multiple videos when I'm doing a video a bag but anyway you guys let me know oh so this is the wig that I got from Timu and I don't want to open it because I'm using this wig in another video so if you want to see this wig you're gonna have to watch wait out for those videos but this is what I was talking about this one came with another uh, with a headband on it um it's not exactly my color style but i have something that i can use with it so watch out for my wig videos coming soon you know because i'll be getting into a lot of stuff hence the name of the channel but um yeah i want to uh, make sure that i have things you know up to par when i make my videos Okay, let's see what this is. Oh, this is a little doll thing from my child, so I'm not going to open that. That's hers. Here. Oh, I got this. Now, I'm hoping that this is going to work out. Hmm. I think I may have not gotten the right one. So now I'm going to have to check on this because the one that I got was supposed to have two, um, two pieces in, in it. It showed two of these. So... And that's another thing that maybe I am just getting one uh, because, what do you call it, Timu shows you all the quantities or combinations and if you don't pick the right thing, you are in trouble. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> so, I got this. I think it was like, this one was about $8, $9, I think. Then it went out of my cart because it runs, it gets sold out, etc., etc., and then we wind up with having to find a similar. Okay, this is another nail product. So we're going to see wig products. We're going to see nail products. We're going to see jewelry. We're going to see other work-related kind of stuff. Um, this I am not happy about. I feel like it show it seems, well, maybe they're just smaller. But they're little rivet, sting pump, rivety kind of things. That are for the nails and they are metallic so you can do your nail and then you can bend it and shape it to the nail and then encapsulate it on your nail for a nice design so yes I don't like the big chunky chunky um, charms that are being used right now but I will put on different uh, different types of um, decal sequins small glitter things like that this is the brush that i wanted to get to dust away right it's so pretty red's my other favorite color so you can use it for your face it says it's a makeup brush 
but I just want it because it, it looks fancy. I think there's a couple more in there too. I bought a couple of other brushes because you know when you have one, you can't have you can't just have one rather. Um, here's another makeup related thing. This is a nail powder, so it turns your nails chrome. I got one in the last order. And it comes with this little spongy thing and you can see the color is a about like i feel like i got a did i order two of these i, I don't know or maybe they send me a second one because they messed up the first one i don't know but you rub this on your nail after your nail paint is dry so you give it a base like um depending on the, the color this one's like a reddish whatever you might paint your nail um Maybe a dark red that you have as a base, and then you rub this once it's dry, and then it becomes chrome, and then you seal it. So, another nail thing that I wanted to try out. I'm just trying to make little piles over here so I could organize later. And well, it would be kind of organized on this table. Ooh, okay, this is okay. This is eyebrow stuff. Everybody's been talking about this brush and whatnot, so. I decided to get one. This brush is that one that will make hair. So as you can see, I do pluck a little bit here, but my eyes are thin. I've just been plucking because I've gotten older, but I've never really had a lot of hair. It's very fine. So this supposedly you can go like this and it will create the effect of hairs. So I got this. Then I got, um, the liquid or let's see what this is this is also part of that so this is the cushion eyebrow gel so it could be together so I have the gel which I've got this brown color and that came with it and I feel like there's something else yes another little brush so you've got like a filler brush for like you know the, the spots and then you've got the actual one that's supposed to create the hairs. I mean, we shall see if this is going to work. <laughs> I don't know. My child's things over there. Anyway, let's put that over there. Now, Timu does offer <laughs> free returns, but I haven't tried to return anything. So this I thought was funny. And I don't know why I got it, but... It might be just for one of my other... It's Well, it's probably for one of my other videos. I don't think I would do this and then go anywhere, really. But look at that. <laughs> what is it? These are freckles. So, <laughs> freckle tattoos, I think, right? Freckle tattoo stickers. So, I thought it would be funny because the biggest deal with freckles when you watch someone and doing freckles on their channel or wherever is that it's hard to get things to look random because when you try to make things random sometimes they come out almost like per perfect or, or just like they, they're not random they don't feel random they seem kind of just you know the same so I wanted to um do them but I thought I would mess up so this one I have no choice it's going to be there okay these are another these are a pair that I've gotten these are like an aquamarine set I have another set that's green two sets that are green I'm kind of wondering I, I don't remember who what because they're gold but they are pretty and when they move it's such such a nice little shine to them so another pair of earrings Okay, this is, what the hell is this? Is this another bandana? If this is a bandana, I'm going to be so upset. Oh, no, this is a face mask. Okay, this is a face mask. Um, yeah, I'm not feeling this. Uh, it doesn't have any structure. I don't know, as soon as you start talking, it slides up or... Okay, so I don't consider myself to have a big head. So this is a, a wash. Um, I'm going to put it in here. I don't know if I'm going to do a return thing because honestly, I it's, you know, 90 days. Yes, free returns. I understand. But come on now. Oh, this is my child. 
Ah, let's see. And it, it, was, it was really pretty. So this is like a gaming mat. It's um, neoprene. And it's got the scene. So you can put this under the desk. She likes to game. And uh, she decided she wanted this mat. So there you go. We've got another one of her things for her. Let me just put it over there. This. I got a bag of rings. I got them. Let's see if the other ones are not clear. No, no. Nearby? No. No. No, no. Interesting. I'm having some interesting feelings coming out here. So, hmm. Okay. Let, 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 me, let me focus. I'm sorry. So, these are rings that I purchased for my fingers. Now, I think in the other videos I have purchased rings and I was telling you that, you know, thicker hands. I usually go with larger sizes and that's not always the case. Now, being that I've been doing my nails, I'm going to keep this back. I decided to get some rings which would be able to be, I used to do this before, be able to be in different spots along the fingers so that that way it can inst uh, accent accent when I do my nails so I'm seeing that there are two of these right let's see two of these uh, a lot of single ones so let me see two of these guys two of this style one of this style with the open another one that has that open that looks like a chain this is a double that you can open but, like, I won't open them because I want them to be stuck higher up by my nails and accentuate that. Another one that's very similar has that opening, but I can leave it there at that height, at that distance. These guys are closed, so wherever they fall, that's kind of where they'll stay. So, like that. Right? And then, I think the rest of these are just plain, um... Yeah, they're just plain round silver. So they can fill in between and whatnot. So this is a nice little bag of rings. Specifically because I'm doing my nails. And I want to accentuate my hands. And I did get another set in black. That's what I was going to try to look for. But I'm like, when we get to it, we get to it. So that's another jewelry thing. Which actually, um, it's alright. I wish there weren't so many repetitious single ones. All right, we have another item here. Now, this they told me was sold out. So I don't know why all of a sudden I'm getting these. But these are ingrown tail, ingrown toenails correctors. So, yes, we have issues here. Somebody has issues here with ingrown toenails. And... I wanted to try these. Let me show you what they are. They are these little tiny silicone. Let's see how soft they are. They're kind of on the soft side, but you stick them on. Let me start. Sorry. You stick them. They have a little opening, like a little ridge. You stick them right, right there. So can you see that? I don't know if it's going to fit. Focus. You just kind of see it. You slide it in onto your fingernail. So let me show you on my thumb. Right, you slide it in like that at the edge of the fingernail of your toe, and then you leave them in there, and that's gonna keep the toe from going into the skin so that you can grow it past um, the edge where you're getting that ingrown issue. I had ordered one because I forgot how many were in here, or maybe the quantity that I ordered, I'm getting two of them, but they told me that it was. Um, sold out I don't know I have these now hey I'm not knocking it but I'm just confused so we'll see if this works because some of the the the, the phone the phone the um toenail correcting things that I watch on YouTube the Tobro for example um yeah some of that is like wow this is to um, hold the wig, so it'll be more for when I have my when I do the videos that I plan to do. I, well, it's, it's, uh, because 
I'm gonna have a wig with me in the video and I want to be able to showcase it by putting it and seeing it in its loveliness so you get two three pieces you're gonna stick these two together you're going to do this and then there is an additional loop on the top that you pop on right yeah, there you go. Um, I, I gotta push it in harder, but we're not gonna waste that much time. And then the wig can hold it and it could stand on your dresser waiting for you to apply the wig. So you'll see this again if you come back. Subscribe. That way you can come back. What's this? Oh, this is to also go with the wigs <laughs> because um, I want to have fun with that little project that I'm thinking of. And my hair is short and I'm actually going to be cutting it before I go back to work because we're on, on break currently. This is, and I love feathers, so this is a headdress that you put on. Ooh. <laughs> headdress like this. So you would, I'm going to put it here just so you could see. Like this would be laying on the back of your hair. And since I don't have any hair, it's not really going to help you but in the front I would go if I had hair this would go like this and this would lay on the hairs and so I don't know it's cute when I have one of those wigs that has a lot of hair you tell me what you think I can already hear some people saying some stuff but I'm gonna leave that for the for the wig videos honestly and just keep it moving here's something in a bag let's just cut this sucker open Oh, dip. this is a dip powder, so another nail product. Um, it is a glittery. It's number 101. It is a Model 1's brand dip powder. I'm going to take off. I just want to see. Um, I don't know if you can see. You really can't see the color. It's pink. I got to get better lighting. It's pink color, and it has chunky glitters. Well, no, actually, this one is not as chunky. I've seen some with some really chunky glitters. So it has glitters in it of different shapes, pink and white. So that is more nail stuff. And feathers are everywhere. Um, oh, nail stuff. We're on a nail stuff roll. So this little sucker here is a palette. Oh, I like the texture on the other side for nails so if you wanted to do some marbling techniques um blend some colors and do some mixing but i love you can kind of see that there's a texture this is pretty you could put this on the desk with the texture up it looks lovely and then when you want to use the palette side which is completely smooth you turn it over do what you have to do oh so this this is i like this it's a leaf i like that um and then it has a set of brushes and a dotting tool so you can do some nail art I'm not gonna take all of these out but there's like some really fine skinny ones and then uh, two thicker ones and then a dotting tool you see that little metal pointy one so yeah so that's nice that, that was a, that came out pretty good I forgot about that I think that might be a gift for somebody if I can remember I gotta double check um, these are for me these are nail art brushes so I'm gonna just take them out the package because I put them over there <laughs> and all the protective heads are coming off so yeah so you've got these fine liners right here that you can draw different things with and then you have the dotting tools which will add in adding shapes to your um, your nail your nails so yeah I like these I don't know, they feel a little bit a little bit short for me, but we'll see. Um, they come with all of these little toppers for you to protect the, the, the hairs, but I usually put them inside something, so I'm not going to worry about that too much, and I'm just going to toss that because they'll be all over the floor before I know it. Okay. Oh, the other stuff I'm into is crafting. So this is a crafting item. This is a die. So what happens is you put the paper and then the paper will cut out these puzzle pieces. So you can cut anything. You can cut a photo. Um, out colored paper, 
um, four of them and then you can have four different colors matched up because they'll match up exactly due to the fact that they were cut with the same dye. So always looking for something that I could use to make uh, cards, pieces on a, on a scrap of page, stuff like that. So yeah, so this is a crafty item. So we're making, we're making all kinds of piles over here. Oh, here's another one. My favorite thing is dream catchers. I have several. You can't see them, but they're over here on this side. I have three dream catchers. I have a dream catcher painting that I did over my bed. So here's a dream catcher. Same thing. Cut it out. Oh, this is a, another headband. So with a little blingy bling in red. I think this is cute. It's looking more silver because the lights are so harsh right here, but it has these little gold pieces and it is that. There you can see the red. So just to have something different, I thought it might look cute with the red hair. Oh, I'll tell you what color the wig was. The red hair of the wig. Let's see how that goes. Alright, another one of these baggies. Let's see, it's probably another nail product. They seem to ship these with the nail products. So this is acrylic powder. Another model ones. Does it say the color? No. It doesn't say a number that I see. So here, yeah, this is what it looks like. And it it seems to be a, another glitter with gold and black. Maybe on a nude. I don't know. I'm going to probably swatch the newest stuff that I've been getting in another video. So if you're into nails, you could watch out for that. Let's see. Okay, I know I need to spade it up. Oh, here we go. So, we are going to go into the next thing of the stuff that I do, which is, look at this, it's so cute, right? You know what this is for? Probably for an aquarium. <laughs> but I have tarantulas, and I'm looking to make another fantasy-based enclosure. So, I will be doing that also on the channel, so... I've gotten some stuff in here, so let's see, that might be the next few items. Um, no, not really, but there might be more of them in here. Ah, I've gotten some um, items in the last one that I had done. So this is uh, gel polish, hand show. I think this is black. Yes, black. I wanted to get another black. Oops. Another black gel polish. So, um, because you want to do designs in black, you need a black base for chrome sometimes. That's a really good base to have and stuff. So, figured I'd get another black one. Another nail product thing. So, you have your uh, stuff, and this is a little uh, place to put your um, tools as you're working so they're not on the surface there's also two little palettes here where you can also do some mixing but it can hold one two three four five devices five different um brushes as you're working so thought this this was really cute just got it in clear white clear 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 white clear white clear white that doesn't make clear white clear because you know why not what the hell is this <laughs> now i'm like questioning i'm i am really gonna have to go back to my orders i don't oh no i remember what this is for okay this is a all right i i, I won't be able to show you it really i wish i had a photo of it but this is a a, a contraption <laughs> which will go around the leg and create like a, a little bit of a a nice little thingy around your thigh so yeah so there's a bunch of these and don't ask me how they get attached but that's for my friend to figure out because this is for her because honey that's not gonna fit around my leg anyway so yeah so that's 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 it's un regalo for somebody else okay this so this is not going to be for nails this is for actually my house this if you don't know what this is it is to push up, uh, well, I'm going to use it for specifically for um, toothpaste. You slip the end, you turn it, and it pushes the toothpaste up. Um, people are using it for the poly gel because the poly gel is a pain. It's very thick, 
Um, there's a lot of air sometimes, so you can push up the uh, poly gel in there. I wish I had something to slip, slip in here and show you, but you get the idea. You put the bottom edge and you just turn it and it just pushes everything up. So this is for toothpaste in my house. Oh, I got another one. Okay, so this one is for me. The other one was for my friend because same thing, you get the brushes, but this is green and green is my color. So I'm going to just take the blue one and put it in here. It's so easy to say, oh, let me get this for this person. Let me get this for that person. When everything is like so mad and expensive. And look, this is the green. It still has that same. I have a scissor. I don't know why I keep opening these things. It has that same like texture on the bottom here. Right? Because, and then the smooth side for your for your for your marbling and, and your mixing. So you can leave it on the table like that. Awesome. Okay, that was mine. That's a gift. Um, I need to speed it up. I know, I know, I know. There's another one of these. And oops, sorry. Um, another set of rings which look exactly the same, but they're just in black. So I'm not gonna go through all of those. Um, another set of these because one for me, one for friends. Okay. This one is another brush. This brush I wanted to use with the nails. Also because you want it just to look so fancy. It's like a rose. Do you accept this rose? Oh, it's shedding. Anyway, so just go sh 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 take off the nail powders and stuff like that. Oh, I like it. It's so cute. It feels sturdy. Yeah, that's good. Okay, more earrings. Let's see. Hmm, interesting. So, it's got these two discs in here, and then it has another bag inside this bag. So, I am not 100% sure what the heck is going on here. It's like DIY your earrings. Yes, it is. So look, you got, oh, well, I guess you can have three earrings in one. You can have a plain old coppery hoop, right? And then you can just have, let's do this. You can just have a, a disc, a wood disc if you want. Or you add that and there's your full on look. I like the way they sound. That's so, it's, I don't know, so satisfying. And I hate ASMR. <laughs> I really do hate ASMR, but some sounds, you know, some sounds are good. Some sounds are nice. Um, yeah, so let's just put the other one together just because I want to throw it off to the side. Yeah, and then they even came with those little clear backs so that the, if you, you know, you don't want the back thing to be pointy and stab you in the neck or something. So there we go. Oh, this is nice. So now I'm seeing difference in coloration, but it could be the different amount of light on it. So that may bother me, but we'll see when I have regular light what that's going to do. If that's going to really drive me crazy or not. Um, the, oh, okay. I believe that I got this for work. So I want to run an extension cord so that I can light up some stuff around the other side. So it is like one of these hooks that you attach. You put the wire here and here, and it'll hold the wire against the wall. It looks about the size of one of those heavy-duty extension cords, and it comes with um, it comes with the adhesive, so that is perfect. So we have that foam adhesive, boogity, 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 and we're good to go. Uh, how many comes in here? I don't know. Okay, I don't know how many comes in here, so sad to say. I'd have to look that up. Where did I put my school stuff? Oh, yeah. Piles. We got piles. Okay. We've got these two items. I know are the same. So I'm going to open one, and I had one, I had gotten one in my other haul. But I just want to open it again to just show this, you guys, that this is a case to hold, you know, you put your brushes in here, right? 
And I'm not putting my brushes in here. I'm putting a tarantula. So that's where these things come in play. Because you'll decorate the interior. And you'll have your piece of wood so that they can climb and they can, you know, make a hide. But then you also have this because, like I said before, tarantulas are observational pets. So you're going to... What the hell? All right. And this is not... Okay. I don't know what's going on. This is so weird. Okay. Okay. That's going to have to stay off. Now that was purchased from Amazon, not from Timo. Um, and if it doesn't act right is gonna have to go back because yeah I don't that I don't like that that's the first time that happened so I've gotten two more because I have some tinier not tinier smallish tarantulas so what I'm gonna have to do is attach something here to make sure that I can put a rubber band to hold this down um, just so that they can't keep themselves out and I'm also gonna have to uh, make some holes in the top and along the side because you need ventilation for them to be able to breathe while they're in here now I'm not digging how this is cloudy this bothers me because you buy these things that are acrylic so that you can see what's inside and I'm not happy with that so that <sighs> yeah I have to think about this but anyway that's what that's for the tarantulas and let's see I have one two three another one of these so it's three of us and um yeah so we've got another pair two more pairs of earrings similar to the other ones that I had gotten before but these are in gold so I have this for me and then another set for a friend. Okay, and the last thing is a makeup bag, which is also for a friend of mine. So, yeah, so obviously their name starts with R. And it's, eh, it's not the best construction, but it is what it is. It's a pretty bag. So, there we go. So yeah, so that's it. So now I'm confused because <sighs> I feel like there's so much that is missing from like first orders and I don't know. It just seems very odd. I feel like this was a more recent order and I feel like, yeah. So I'm going to jump on the Timu app. I'm going to see about this as well because I could have sworn I bought the one with the two um, speakers because, you know, even though I'm by myself here, I may have friends come by and want to do things with me. And I do have other channels where I do other things. So, yeah. Anyway, that's where we're at. You got some insight into me and all the stuff that I do. And so if you want to check out other my shenanigans and this and that and the other, unboxings and nail stuff, tarantula stuff, um, stuff with the wigs, <laughs> by all means, subscribe. Um, like the channel, don't like the channel, leave me a comment. Does it bother you that I don't put the names and the, and the links in the description? Um, is that something that makes or breaks you watching a video? You know, I'm just getting back into all of this. So... Until next time, I will see you. So, ciao, ciao. Bye.